get my six. Guys, welcome to an early video. We usually upload in the afternoon, late afternoon, early evening. But I'm out here early this morning because we're going to walk back the cat. If you never had a security clearance, don't know much about certain agencies, what that means is we're going to take information that we have access to and walk it back to the original source. I've probably said too much already, but I wanted to let you know what's going on. So here's why we're doing it. <clears throat> At this very spot last night, we did a live stream. I want to thank everybody for being on that live stream who was there. Well, thank you for all the super chats. It was never really a plan of us, of ours, to set that up. But YouTube always, they say, oh, now you can do this. Now you can do that. And we did that. And you guys are so wonderful. I appreciate that because I'm into um, Twinkies and taxes. Love buying Twinkies, pay a lot of taxes. You guys really helped out with that, with those super chats. Thank you to each and every one of you. Now, if you missed the live stream, here's what you missed. We started out actually up at the campground, but something kept interfering with the signal. So we had to move all the way down here to the front of the house. I'm in like right in front of the pond, right in front of my house. See, you can hear a bullfrog over there trying to get some attention. Now I went back and reviewed some of the footage this morning from both of those videos. And a couple people pointed out that I was followed from the campground, okay? I don't know, I didn't see it, but I do know that last night while we were right here at this location, I walked up to the wood, wood line. Something was definitely creeping around. We heard it, we, we heard, we saw eye shine, and we got a glimpse of something running behind me. Something that appeared to be on two legs, taller than me. We saw its eyes as it ran back. So I, of course, ran back here. <clears throat> And then just within minutes of being here, the eye shine started showing up again. From this angle, we can see directly where that eye shine was coming from. It was right there around the wood piles. So what we're going to do now is I'm going to flip the phone around. We're going to go back, stay in line with where we saw the eye shine, where we were last night, where we heard something up there and where we believe we saw something run behind us. And we're going to look for tracks. We're going to look for any other evidence. I'm going to start walking back like this, walking back the cat, as they say in the agency. I use weird terminology there. Whatever. It's all readily available in the public library, so I'm not disclosing anything. I wanted to show you this, though. Check this out. It's a mimosa tree. Isn't it beautiful? These are in full bloom. We've got several of them here around our pond. They're just absolutely gorgeous. They smell good. They smell better than glue sticks. So I'm just going back to the wood pile. So while we're walking back there, keep getting my six. Yes, I'm trying to make it look like I'm not looking where I'm going, because not only am I not, but because if he, she, it, or they are out there trying to get a glimpse, I don't want them to think I'm seeing them. So you've got to be the ones to see them. I'll see them later when I review the tape. We're going to address some uh, comments. I was doing that a lot last night in the live stream, but I missed some, and some of y'all missed the live stream, but you came back and somebody said, they were just curious. They, they said they didn't want to be offensive, but they were wondering how I acquired my beautiful property. I'm not offended. I got it the old fashioned way. I bought it. Now, follow up question, because I get asked this a lot. I think it's because I live in an, in an affluent area where most people inherit everything they have. A lot of trust babies around here and we kind of don't fit that mold. So then the next question is, where'd you get the money to buy it? I got that the old fashioned way too, I worked for it. Okay, keep getting my six. Okay, here's one, I got a couple like this, here. I know this is your channel, but must you really point out that you're a writer and you can buy your books on Amazon in the link provided in the description box of this video? Must you say this in every video you make? Nah, I guess not. Just to prove it, I won't mention it in this one. Okay, so here's a wood pile. Let me flip the phone. Wait a minute, let's see. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. I'm going to flip the phone. We're going to investigate the wood pile. 
and then back up in here. We're gonna make our way up into here because this is where we potentially saw something run behind us last night in live feed. Okay, the phone is flipped. Here's the wood pile. You know, it's early out here and it's already like in the 80s and humid as can be. Oh, what's that up there? Saw a beautiful blue jay light right there on my brush pile. That's where I put my brush pile out of sight. There's a wood pile. Doesn't appear to be anything hiding back here now. Ugh, look at that. You see, tell how that grass is crushed down right there. Over here too, you see that? Look, this grass is standing up. This has been pushed down. Something was back here. Something was back here, right there as well. And now look, remember our angle? Remember our angle, our original angle? We were right there in front of the house, by the pond, just in front of the mimosa tree. So this is directly in line with where we saw the eyes shine last night. And now we come back this morning to investigate. Oh, look over there, that's been pushed down too some, hasn't it? Hmm. There's a walnut tree I'm gonna have to transfer next March when I can do so without killing it because it's dormant. That'd be a beautiful tree added to my man-made forest down by the road. All right, well, let's keep going. Let's walk up here. Make sure we check all this out. Make sure there's nothing up here waiting on us. I need to get some more wood, that's all right. Got plenty of time. Now, you guys are getting my view. You know, usually when I come up here this time of day in the mornings, I see that indigo bunting up here. They're nesting up here in these sourwood trees. It's a beautiful bird. It's like metallic green. There's that blue jay sitting on top of that brush pile. Can you see it or is it too far? Right there, that's a blue jay. Isn't it beautiful? So, let's pan back out. This is where we heard something. Right in through here, and then right up here is where we saw something run behind us, and we saw eye shine. So we're gonna go up here. That blue jay's just hanging out. I just heard a tree knock. Oh, she's pregnant. That's a pregnant blue jay. Guys, I'm hearing tree knocks. There she goes. Is she trying to warn me or is she trying to warn someone else? Okay, so here is where something ran right up this trail right behind us and back into these woods over here. blackberries that one's ripe ah. gonna eat it before the birds do This is like something was scraping the ground right here, maybe moving leaves around so they could stand here and not be heard from crumpling leaves. I know hunters will do that. Wait, what was that? There's something in here. footsteps what's that
Well, guys, we've come out and investigated the morning after. There's something back here. I'm hearing something walking around. Oh, there was another comment. Hold on, let me get my phone. I notice how you always, aside from mentioning your books, which are available on Amazon in the link in the description box of this video, you also seem to showcase your t-shirts, which are available for sale on Teespring by scrolling down below this video. Must you do this in all of your videos? No. Wow. Guys, that's weird. It's like this portal. Some of you guys have mentioned before portals behind me. It's like this one just opened up. Right back behind that X. I don't remember it ever being that clear. Do you? Something's going on up here. Potentially. Heard a tree knock. Confirmation, perhaps? You have to come back from... What the heck? Did you guys see that standing right there? And now it's gone? I'm gone too. I'm going back to the house, even though it's broad daylight. Thanks for being here for another episode of the PBS. S. The potential Bigfoot Sasquatch. Show.